Hello there, I'm the Nightmare Duke and welcome to another Fallout 76 video where today we are going to be taking a look at a weapon that you don't really ever see. No, it's not the fixer that I'm currently using, just in case you're wondering. Now I see low level players and new players rocking up and smacking things with pool cues and lead pipes and the occasional high level player role playing and running around with a switchblade or just because they're bored. But basically there's one weapon I never see. So hopefully you enjoy and if you do then hey, consider liking and subscribing. Sticking around for more Fallout content, let's just get straight into things. So the weapon is the crossbow. Now if you use this regularly or as your main weapon, let me know down in the comments. But at least in my time playing the game and the servers that I'm in, I basically never see anyone with a crossbow. Occasional compound bow, sure, bit of it on the compound bow recently and it is a good weapon and you can get those one shot kills, no problem. But what about the crossbow? So I figured I'd jump in and see what it can do and maybe why no one uses it. So I do have a bloodied, that's critical role here, explosive frame. So we're sitting at decent damage there and going over the build, it's basically the same as the one I was using for the compound bow. Got all the cards we need, maxed out the archer ones, demo expert, all the sneak stuff. So we have a stacked build here. Of course, running Nerd Rage, got the covert up, bloody mess, better criticals and follow through over in the legendary slot. Mutations, if you're interested in those, not going to be running any of the other buffs, but let's just start off with some super mutants. So for the most part, it's not a terrible weapon, but even on this roll, generally against your level 100s, it's going to be a two shot kill. And even on the lower levels, a lot of the time it's two shots to kill. But if you've got your adrenaline proct and stuff like Gong Fu helping out and you're using it in VAT, then you can start getting those one shot kills similar to the compound bow. However, just requiring more setup to build up to that point, basically. Crit shots, though, will definitely be the one shot kill on your level 100 super mutants. So this is a weapon that can benefit from aiming your build towards crit shots and trying to get the most out of them. So swapping in something like crit savvy uh, to make sure you have your crits. Uh, bar full more of the time can be a way to go and some of the other crit per cards or you know legendary effect to fill your critical meter quicker probably a much better route but over to some robots very similar two shots seems pretty standard for the crossbow on a lot of enemies uh, until you build up that extra damage from your per cards and if you're going to be running a couple of buffs then you can put yourself in a one shot kill range but against these robots here of course that one just kind of missed but generally two shots one shot with the crit, the protectrons, two shots. So generally the crossbow is sitting in that two shot range quite comfortably. So not terrible, but not exceptional either. But on stuff like your bigger tankier enemies, like the behemoth, of course, this isn't a fast DPS weapon, but a couple of bolts and the behemoth is taken care of. So again, not terrible. And if you go for the more crit focused option instead, then definitely will require fewer shots on the bigger targets like the behemoth. Uh, Deathclaw here were two shots. Level 100 Deathclaw would more than likely be three or four maybe. They, they just would not spawn for me today. But yeah, I can understand why people will choose something like the compound bow instead since it's an identical build setup and you can get one shot kills from the start way, way easier and requiring far less uh, build up of those perks like adrenaline and gung fu to help it out. Of course, can't get quad on it anymore. Having multiple shots is super fun on the crossbow. So it was always fun to use in nuclear winter, but since Wastelanders it can't roll with quad. So there are legacies out there for the crossbow that have quad, which is super fun to use for a build, but just extremely rare. But let me know if you often see people using a crossbow or if you yourself use it, but hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, then hey, consider liking and subscribing. And as always, massive thank you to the channel members. But for now, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.